Meat, do you have three hearts, like octopuses? Oh, Pombamondak, you always bring up the most interesting questions. Indeed, I do possess three hearts, just like those charming cephalopods. It certainly keeps me feeling incredible. How many hearts do you need, Meat? I can give you one of mine. Oh, Dragon 1170, what a generous offer. I currently possess three hearts and jars, including one human heart. Thank you for your kind, hearted gesture, it warms my ink-filled soul. Ahem, did you know that I once climbed to the top of Big Ben to fix the clock hands? Quite the adventure indeed. But don't go spreading this secret far and wide. Meet what differentiates you from your evil counterpart. Ah, oh, an intriguing question, my dear Awaz. Well, you see, while I may indulge in the occasional incredible mischief, my intentions are always guided by goodwill and mirth. Evil meat, on the other hand, tends to revel in chaos and darker pursuits. How are your clones created? Oh, the process of creating my clones is quite fascinating, really. You see, every time a certain condition is met during the stream, Otto-chan whips out the cloning device and voila, a new meteor is born. It's all rather magical, don't you think? Meet what if the tentacles grab your clone and do stuff to her, will you stand by and watch? Oh my stars and garters. That's, um, quite the peculiar question, isn't it? Well, let's just say. Increlated adventures might ensue if such a scenario were to unfold. But fear not, my dear viewers, for Meteora always finds a way to turn the tide.